Okay, so this vlog is gonna be a little different in that I'm going to help walk you through everything. I realized as I was editing this, I didn't really give much context to a lot of what was happening and I'm in different spots super randomly. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna go through this together. Hold my hand. Supposed to be 12.30. Now it's 6.30. So in the last three days, I've had like six flights canceled on me. There was a crazy storm that basically ransacked Denver airport and the entire East Coast. So basically anyone that was trying to fly somewhere couldn't get anywhere. I've been on the phone with the airport reps. I'm like, you gotta get me to Portland, Maine. I have to get in. And they're like, there's nothing. So the reason this was all mission critical is because we had a TV shoot on Monday. We were supposed to shoot for the Snow Country snapshot at Sugarloaf. And if we didn't get there, we would have missed it all together. And that would have been terrible. Finally, I find a flight into Boston. I'm like, okay, slightly longer drive, but we'll get me there in time. I think it's the saving grace. I get to the airport, the flight's supposed to take off at 12.30. I walk up to the desk to check my bag and like, you know about the delay, right? What? My flight was delayed six hours. So, I'm still here. <laughs> So I was gonna fly into Boston that night and then drive up four hours. But by the time we landed, it was 2 a.m. It just wouldn't have been possible. So we took a pit stop in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. And if you've never been there, it's a super cool town and very, very pretty in the summertime. I have to tell you about Shitty Flute. If you guys don't know about Shitty Fluted on YouTube, you have to go watch it. It is fantastic. It's exactly what the name is. Shitty Flute. <laughs> the take on me is still one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 a lot of this is behind the scenes. If you want to see some of the actual TV segment that we filmed, you can go to the link below. I will link it in the description. <laughs> right after we left Sugarloaf, we drove all the way down to Waterville Valley. No, Gunstock. Yeah, we went to Gunstock. No, did we? So what happened was we left Sugarloaf, that was Monday and actually Tuesday morning a little bit. Then we drove down to Gunstock, New Hampshire, which is a ski resort in Guilford, New Hampshire, and we filmed there on Wednesday. I actually have no behind the scenes footage from that shoot, but I do have some clips from our shoot and here they are. After Gunstock, we zipped up to Waterville Valley, New Hampshire. It's only about an hour north of Gunstock, so that was a pretty easy commute, given what we had been through earlier in the week. <laughs> yeah, it's snowing. We're at Waterville Valley, and we're gonna have some fun today. Woo! Oh, almost dropped the camera. Like, I got it because it has the flip-up screen. Oh my gosh, that's Which is beautiful. super cool, right? Yeah, and then you have that, that low aperture. You get that blurry background depth of field. Mm -hmm. I forgot to tell you guys that I got the Sony RX100 Mark V. That's what I'm filming on right now. And we're indoors. You guys are in the vlog. They care, they care. Waterville Valley. It's my first time here. We're about to get some breakfast. What? It's closed too? Where did
does someone eat around here? <laughs> you found it. <laughs> the snow is outrageous. It's perfectly groomed. And then there's like four to five inches on top of it. <laughs> Just got off the mountain. Now we are in Waterville Valley Marketing. I heard that you can get shot with a Nerf gun here very easily. So I'm being extra careful. See, there it is. Can you demonstrate how that works, Tom? Careful, you poke your eye out. Ah! <laughs> I knew it. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> so we finished our shoot at Waterville Valley in New Hampshire and then drove up to Smuggler's Notch, which is in northern Vermont, right near Stowe. Okay, so we just got to Smuggler's Notch in Vermont. We were at Waterville Valley earlier today. It was such a fun day. Oh my God, the snow is outrageous. Right now we're going to head over to the Torchlight Parade and Fireworks. I'm so excited. Okay, and one of the best meals I had on this trip was at Smuggler's Notch. It's called Hearth and Candle. If you're ever at Smuggler's Notch, you have to eat at this place. Get the short ribs. Seriously, this week for the snapshot, we hit four resorts in five days. Whew. And that pretty much sums up this week. Sorry, I needed to kind of jump in here and narrate it, but if you like this style, maybe we could do this a little more often. Probably not. Also, I got this camera, the Sony RX100 Mark V. All of this vlog was taken using this. This camera is sweet, I love it. There is a little bit of a caveat though. I had an interesting experience with this. Shortly after this vlog, this thing crapped out on me. I'll put together a separate video about that, kind of with the video of what this thing was doing and why I needed to exchange it for a new one. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like the vlogs. I have so much fun making them and it's just kind of fun to be able to share all of the behind the scenes that goes into making all of the different ski and snowboard videos and TV things that we do. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. About Snappy's Tube Steaks, uh, <laughs> cleverly named and wildly topped hot dogs. Yeah. Uh, the first name was gonna be, oh Jesus, it was gonna be Fast Eddie's Rod Dogs. <laughs> And uh, that was just absolute wonderful time. Come on down, let us slide one into you. <laughs>